welcome back to Down Does Things. My name is Dano and thank you so much for watching this video. Today I present to you my free Matisse inspired printable which I will show you how to use to make pretty much endless amounts of art. Quick background, Henry Matisse was a French artist who was born in 1869. Matisse was mainly a painter but in his later years when health issues made it harder to paint and to sculpt he started doing collages made from cut paper. Today's project is inspired by those later works. The first thing you need to do is go to danodoesthings.com where you can download and then print this free template. The direct link is in the description box below. I suggest printing it on cardstock or a bit of a heavier paper just to make it easier to use. In addition to the template, you will need a canvas of your choice. It can be square or rectangular, just smaller than 10 by 10 inches works best for this project. You can keep it white or you can paint it a sort of off-white tan color like I did. Sheets of craft felt in your chosen colors. Scissors, one for paper and one for your felt if you are a scissor snob like I am. Some glue, my preferred is Aileen's Tacky Glue. And of course the courage to learn, have fun, and be creative. The idea behind this template is you can use it as a guide to make a completely customized piece of art. I'll show you how to do that and then give you some inspiration through the three pieces that I made. I've printed my template and have cut out all the pieces. Now I'm just going to lay them out on my canvas until I get a pattern that I like. Remember, you can use all of the pieces, just some of the pieces. You can rotate them and flip them and even use the same piece multiple times on one canvas. Once I've got a pattern that I like, I'll look at the colors of felt that I have. I'll decide if I want to do a limited palette or include lots of the right colors. Once the colors are picked out, I'll then trace all my pieces onto the felt, cut out the felt, and then glue them down to the canvas. Of course, if you have an iPad with Procreate, you can always try out your pattern and colors digitally first. Make sure that the template is saved to your iPad. Then open a new screen size canvas and on the left side draw out an approximation of your physical canvas, whether it's square or rectangular or what have you. Then insert the template picture on the right. Now you can copy and paste the different pieces onto your canvas and play around with where they'll go. You can also try out colors and really get an idea for your final project before you put scissors to felt. Now let's get to some examples and inspiration. For this first canvas, I decided to use only one shape and cut it out in four different colors of felt and arrange the pieces in a simple design. For this canvas, I used a few similar pieces and kept all the felt colors in brown tones. This gives it a sort of cool monochrome look. For this last canvas, I went all out using all of the pieces from the template and a lot of different colors of felt.
As you can see, this one template can lead to many different styles and vibes of artwork. If you make one of these Matisse-inspired canvases, I would love to see how yours turns out. Share it on Instagram and don't forget to tag me at DanoDoesThings. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button and subscribe for more crafty content every Wednesday or Thursday. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next week.